left hand. touch of rain this morning it's working fine again it is exactly lunchtime 1200 hours for that northern train service from Leeds booked in for 12.02 was LNER service from London King's Cross, which is delayed by eight minutes and expected in the next three minutes. Give or take because of the pathing in the timetable, but currently is about three and four minutes away.
loaded for this one might equal to be a third train after it. Because the one after was expected in three minutes time. London Kings Cross. Third and final will be the 11.52 intermodal from Wakefield to Felixstowe, he's about two minutes away. <laughs> I'm sending it on the down. I keep moving up, okay. came down eight minutes ago and the longest waiting delay was from the train we've just had. Third and final train shortly approaching. It's six or nine three. plenty of time to get these back up again. They came down 10 minutes ago. <laughs> no, East Midlands Railway will not be.
course we do wait for the next decision it's strike up day time on saturday the 2nd of december there'll be no lner or east midlands railway services following on that affecting us here on friday the 8th of december there'll be no northern train services there we go Let's let this one out then, I suppose it leaves in one and a half minutes anyway. Clear closure 12.14 for the 12.15 at Northern Train Service to Leeds. Which again will not be operating on Friday the 8th of December due to planned driver industrial action. So again LNER and EMRO on the 2nd, Northern O on the 8th and everyone else in the country in between. A long time and full overtime ban between Friday the 1st of December and Saturday the 9th. The RMT managed to get to the table to do a deal, but Mick Wallen won't approach the table. They can try and argue the side of the story as much as they like, but operators aren't sure whether they're actually going to put their amended timetables out or not. I've got someone travelling on the second who needs EMR to refund, but they're refusing to say if they are actually out or not. But memo from the RMT, the ASLF union, says that they will be, but the operators are refusing to acknowledge it because they're obviously wanting that resolution, not just to waste valuable time again. Because if we work through the previous years, we would have, if we had the market this year, that would have been the third in a row impacted by strike action during its booked times. Which is not a good Im image for anybody. It's turkeys voting for Christmas, voting to bloody eat themselves because there'll be no money left to pay for the dinner. One of us are a 2 4. 